Hello my friends, Sarah Hall here. I get a lot of questions on the topic of how to keep your energy field clear of other people's emotions, attachments, or negativity. When you're spiritually sensitive, it can be easy to pick up on other people's energy. But there is no reason why this has to result in your feeling uncomfortable, drained, or overwhelmed in others' presence. You have complete sovereignty over your energetic, emotional, and physical state of being. And the key to keeping yourself clear of others' energy is raising your vibration. All things in existence hold their own vibration. Every physical object has a vibration, every thought and every emotion. The overall state of your habitual thoughts, beliefs, actions, and feelings creates a momentum that results in your signature vibration. Generally, higher vibrations are associated with light and fast-moving energy, like the fluttering of a hummingbird or angel's wings. Higher vibrations are also connected to broad perspectives, increased awareness, and love-based feelings. Lower vibrations are connected to lower moods, stuck or limited perspectives, and fear-based feelings. Our vibration fluctuates slightly with each and every thought that we think. When we maintain positive, uplifted thoughts throughout our waking hours, our vibration tends to anchor itself in higher vibrations and then remain strongly there, as if the higher realm is now your home base. And the more you practice maintaining these higher vibrational states of being, the less likely it becomes that others' energy particular if it is uncomfortable or lower energy, will stick to you. This is because your energy field has become like a fast-moving stream. When others' energy comes in contact with you, your flow is moving so powerfully and so fast that their energy can only choose to flow with your current. Furthermore, you cannot grasp, adhere to, or manipulate a person with a high vibration any more than you could easily grasp, adhere to, or manipulate a fast-moving river. If you want to connect with that river, you have to discover how to flow with it. Which brings us to the concept of entrainment. Entrainment refers to the synchronization of organisms to a perceived rhythm. When your vibration remains the highest and strongest thing in the room, then others' energy will naturally entrain up to your frequency and find a way to harmonize with it. This is natural spiritual law. When you maintain a high vibration, you naturally light up the room. Others begin to match and harmonize with your state in a way that allows your vibration to continue to sing out freely. You'll also find that those who perhaps cannot harmonize with your vibration begin to fall away. Types of people who would normally drain you or seek to set a negative tone in a relationship simply stop showing up in your life. You don't attract them because you're now vibrating at a level of being that they don't resonate with. So the key to keeping your energy field clear, avoiding feeling overwhelmed or drained, and preventing etheric cords from ever forming on your energy body is to do what it takes to maintain a high vibration. Choose thoughts and words that feed an uplifted, positive, love-based outlook on life. Choose lifestyle activities that feed healthy, uplifted feelings in your body, mind, and spirit. Choose a self-concept that reflects the truth of your innate, unlimited divinity and lovability. And choose to relate with others in such a way that you will not trade your peace for anything. Choose to relate with the world in such a way in which you are affirming love, well-being, and empowerment within yourself and others. Choose to remain steadfast in abstaining from attachments to concepts of lack and limitation in your conversations and observations with others. Because there is always a way to face anything in this world no matter how seemingly negative, with a perspective of empowerment, compassion, and love that does not affirm weakness or victimhood, but affirms that here too, 
love has unlimited power and potential to transform, create, and heal. Thank you, beautiful soul, for listening to these messages that I received with the help of the angels. And before we say goodbye, I would like to put a blessing on you. So place your hands over your heart if that feels good. Take a deep healing breath and visualize as a beautiful, sparkling, white and soft amethyst purple colored light begins to shower you from above. I call upon the angels, the Holy Mother, the wise ones in heaven, and all of the loving beings who watch over you and I. Heavenly Council, please guide, uplift, and protect us on our life's journey. Guide us to shape our thoughts like artists, sculpting our consciousness with pure intention. Help us to remain light of heart and vibrant of spirit. Keep the flames of hope brightly lit within us. Show us your wise ways and help us to see as God would have us see. In this way, may we become beacons of Source's pure love presence on earth. May the love that created the universe be the strength that helps us to remain anchored to heaven now and always. And so it is for you and me and for all beings to be in a state of light, peace, and freedom. Thank you, beautiful beings. My prayers go with you. And know until we meet again, that you are so loved and so very blessed. Bye.